In the last video, I told you about the strange relationship between the meter and one of the most fundamental ancient Egyptian units of measurement, the Royal Egyptian Cubit. First, let's check the history of the meter. The meter was officially chosen in the 18th century as a scientific unit of measurement based on Earth's circumference, to be exact, one ten millionth part of the distance from North Pole to Equator along a meridian. You could think of it as a harmonic subdivision of a cosmic distance, keep that in mind. But what does that have to do with ancient Egypt? Well, let's check out the Great Pyramid's location on the planet. The Great Pyramid sits at around 30 degree northern latitude. If you watched the previous video, you will notice that you could think of this as a royal Egyptian cubit on the circle of Earth's circumference, starting from the equator, all in relationship to the meter. Now this is where it gets scary. Any physicists watching? Then you might know this number. It's the speed of light in meters per second. Now watch what happens if we use this number as a coordinate, simply by removing a few powers of 10. Let's type it into Google Maps, and where do we land? Right on the apex of the Great Pyramid of Giza.